Now the shoemaker heard about the king's troubles. And he thought to himself, well I've got these magic shoes and I can fly anywhere. So if I take them to the king, he can put them on and he can fly and see the wicked king and stop this war before it starts. So immediately the shoemaker packed all these things up and he started the long journey to the king's castle. Shimaku arrived at the castle, he knocked on the big gates, and the guard came to the gate. And he said, I want to see the king. And the guard wouldn't let him in, you see. So the Shimaku thought to himself, he said, I'll put these shoes on and I'll tell them to fly me to the king's chamber. So he put the shoes on. He said, the king's chamber. He went up flying in the sky, way up, way up in the sky, and in through the king's bedroom. And the king was absolutely struck down and he couldn't say anything. So the shoemaker, before the king had a chance to say anything and get his voice back, 
He explained to him about his shoes and he told him how he'd like to help him.